recently, I'm sure you saw the ads for this, but the much-anticipated premiere of the new horror film, Halloween Kills, mm. oh. starring the infamous killer Michael Myers, just dropped. Oh. Wow. I don't watch those things. <laughs> this I haven't is seen it yet. the 12th installment in the franchise. Wow. And surprising to many, it was number one at the box office in its opening weekend. Wow. Bringing in $50 million, which is pretty big for an R-rated sequel mid-pandemic. Yeah, yeah, that's not bad at all. Is this the one that Jamie Lee Curtis is in? Right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. She's in it? Like, she's I keep... in a lot of these. She's in almost all of them. She's like <laughs> 110 at this point, right? Am I right? Pretty much. <laughs> so a lot of people want to know, is the film just hype or is is it actually worth your hard-earned dollar? Okay, We're yeah. going to try to attempt to answer that <gasps> question Oh yes! by checking in with our own resident film critic, Jose Bolaños, Yay! for another drunk or maybe something else oh, movie God. review. <laughs> okay. And as always, Jose attended the movie the other night in theaters. And Jose, what were your thoughts going into this? Because we all know just how much you love scary stuff. Uh, yeah, I hate scary stuff. <laughs> <laughs> But you have kind of been into scary movies lately. Yeah, I'm actually getting it. Like I'm like, okay, I want to go watch it, but I'm going to be scared. I don't want to do it. Okay. But I got to think I need to do it because it's Halloween. But, ah! So I'm kind of in this okay. like, scared, excited mode. Okay. Jose's like hyping himself up yeah, just in the car. Yeah, He's yeah. like, really? <laughs> Mind you, this is how he feels sober. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is before. Well, not completely sober. Yeah, not necessarily. But let's go ahead and listen to Jose's first clip as he tries to tell us about the plot of the movie. So, this guy comes <laughs> out and kills people on Halloween. And every Halloween, these people are like, be safe out there. And I'm like, what, what are you even participating in life on this day this is a day of murder and horror in your town but they're always like doo, doo, doo. oh we're going to the park at midnight yeah 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 there's been 50 murders recently but it's okay it's only halloween the one night this guy comes out then they're like oh hey kiddos i know you're out playing in the street on halloween at midnight but there's about 17 teenagers got slaughtered about a block away. I would go home. And then the cops will just drive away and, like, not even, like, take them home. I'm like, you're a police officer. Get those kids in your car like a circus clown and get those children back to their families. He's just like, all right, we'll follow the blood trail home, kiddos. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> me a promotion. <laughs> Jose, you bring up oh a God. pretty good point, yeah. actually. I mean, very slowly. He brings up the point very yeah. like it speech. Is. Oh, my yeah, God. There's yeah. a lot of stuff very going on slow. inside of me. You would have been the first person killed in that movie. Yeah, Just from totally. the sound of your yeah. voice alone. Yeah. Being a teenager, <laughs> playing video games. Yeah, absolutely. Why do they up? keep going out on Halloween? Yeah. There's been, like, murders on Halloween <laughs> night, like, 14 of the last 30 exactly. years there. Yeah. Well, <laughs> exactly. They're not it's playing like, the odds. No. <laughs> or they're not reading the news. Yeah. Or they think it's all fake news oh, in this town. That's the problem. They're like, I don't believe oh, it. Mainstream media <laughs> reported it? Nah. Yeah. <laughs> Let's all go to the park at midnight. <laughs> anyway. 50 it, movies later. It's another <laughs> drunk. Or maybe something else. Movie review with Jose Bolaños. Yes. And say we're listening to him review the new horror movie Halloween Kills. And the star of this movie is actress Jamie Lee Curtis, mm -hmm. who appeared in the original Halloween film, over 40 years ago now. Wow. Yeah, Has it crazy. been that long? Yeah, everybody knows who she is. Yeah. Alexis, do you, I do too. you yep. know who she I know. is. That's surprising, uh, right? Wow. What, what yeah. do you remember her from? Isn't she in Freaky Friday? Yeah, totally. Yes. That's all I know. She is in that one. <laughs> so what was Jose's take on Jamie Lee Curtis's performance? Jamie Lee Curtis is in it, which I love her. And she's really old now, which makes me sad. It's another kind of horror. When life hits you. You know, Michael Myers, he, he may be chasing you, creeping, it's nighttime and Halloween, but you know, it's always around the corner, man. It's life. Yeah. It's always there. You know, you look in the mirror and you're like, oh man, is that a gray hair? <laughs> and then you're like, wait a minute, what time is it? <laughs> it doesn't matter because no one's waiting for me, you know? <laughs> Who cares? Yeah, then, and then you, uh, 
Um, <laughs> we were talking about Jamie Lee Curtis. <laughs> oh my god, oh. it's so accurate. Wow. Yeah. Life is the ultimate serial killer. Yeah, but how come Jason depressing. never gets like old? Like he throws out his back when he's trying to like <laughs> kill somebody. Yeah. Yeah. Jason is not the killer in this movie. Oh, he's though. Not, he's yeah. in it's Michael Myers. Myers. Oh, either oh, yeah. way. I mean, but Jose, I think you bring up a good point. You don't really even need killers in these movies at all. Yeah. We don't need yeah. Michael Myers or Jason or Chucky or any oh. of them. Let's just do a movie called Life. Yeah, Aww. it's the slow game. It's very slow. It's just crippling debt and having to stay with your in-laws for the weekend. Oh, no, that's no. torture. Yeah. That is terrifying. That's different than death. It's still, <laughs> death. Yeah. We still come around the corner and scream yeah. in that plot. <laughs> For real. As we mentioned earlier, the real star of this is the villain, Michael Myers, who's been terrorizing the small town of Haddonfield, Illinois, for years now. So what does Jose think of him? Well, dude, he's honestly, he, he is creepy because he is, like, slow and persistent. Like, he, he's actually really fit, if you think about it. This guy is, like, a stocky... Gaston, he must train. Dude, do you think that's what he's doing? The 346 days between Halloweens? I bet he does CrossFit. You can just tell. You know, he's got like a, like a jumpsuit or like some kind of like jan like janitorial outfit or some kind of jumpsuit, and like it fits him real well. You know what I'm saying? Like ladies like that. Alexis, sounds like a boyfriend. Uh, <laughs> I mean, he's kind of clingy, though. She may not like that. And I don't think he has any money. He's, I don't know, though. He may be rich. He doesn't rob anybody. After he kills them, like, I would take your shoes and your wallet. <laughs> okay. Well, I appreciate Hot. you looking out for me. Okay. You. you know, and I just realized he's been in how many movies? The guy probably is rich. Yeah. Oh, you think that, you think that's a Gucci jumpsuit? He's <laughs> yeah, wearing. He's yeah. Yeah. <laughs> for sure. For sure. But he's not stealing enough from his no. victims. Well, if he, he was poor, he, he would steal. Exactly. From you. He doesn't mm. need the money. Oh, yeah. okay. Okay. This yeah. is just a sport for him. Absolutely. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. You think you could get me in contact? We could just talk a little. Maybe. Yeah. Alexis, you are interested. I know. I mean, Jose's trying to set me up. I got. He's tall. <laughs> well, Very tall. It's been interesting so far. When we come back, we'll hear more of Jose's drunk or maybe something else movie review about the new Halloween Kills movie. Okay. And you'll even hear why Jose says this. You don't have to have experience. Huh? <laughs> what? I don't know what that is, but I'm sure it's a very oh, cohesive, no. well thought out I'm point sure. that you're yeah, about to make. Bet. We're going to hear it next. He's not sober. <laughs> he's not drunk. He, he's not buzz. It's drunk <laughs> movie reviews with Jose. <laughs> Intro's done. Let's f rock this movie review, Jeffrey. <laughs> <laughs> If you went to, you, to a highly prestigious four-year college or even an Ivy League university and you're yeah. listening to this, I'm just curious, why? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? They hate brain cells. <laughs> they do. They hate they, brain cells. They, oh, okay. they listen to us because they don't want to think. Yep. Well, then you come to the right place because it's another drunk or maybe something else movie review with yeah. Jose Bolaños. All right. And today he's reviewing the new horror film <laughs> Halloween Kills. Mm -hmm. So far... What have we learned? Dude, uh, that life is scary. Yeah. yeah. yeah that getting old, just like Jamie Lee Curtis, is hard. Yeah, and that makes Jose very sad yeah. to see yeah, Jamie like, Lee Curtis so old. I know. She's looking good, though. Also, he thinks the killer Michael Miles is ripped and super hunky. Could <laughs> even be a good partner for our young Alexis I guess here. So. Yeah. With or without the mask. <laughs> <laughs> and that leads us to our next clip because Jose actually has some thoughts on what happens to Michael Myers when the Halloween franchise finally runs out of steam. Uh -oh. What should he do with his career next? Oh, good point. He's buff. He's pro he's a great actor. I could see him like in a rom-com, probably <laughs> something with J-Lo. The most romantic part of the movie would be when... They're they're goofing, you know, they're goofing around and like she's in a shopping cart for no reason <laughs> and he's pushing her wee, and then the cart falls over oh. and they both tumble down like a small grassy hill, which no one gets hurt at all. Oh. <laughs> and they, he falls on top of her and they're like, <laughs> and then like everything stops. 
And then Michael Myers, he takes his mask up just a little bit and just gives her a little... Mike and Julia in Dead in Love. I like it. Cut and print it. <laughs> the spin off. It sounds like an Oscar winner to me. Wow. I like how he only raises his mask just a little bit. Yeah. Just, just enough just for enough. his mouth to pop out. <laughs> I'm, can't, you can't see her or anything. No. no. And I'm confused yeah. how the shopping cart gets out to a field, but that's okay. Yeah. They were all details. <laughs> I mean, it's a rom com. No exactly. one knows. Yeah. It's like there's oh. always shopping carts. It has to be raining, too. Yeah, right? and it's raining. Oh, we're yeah. so silly. Oh, my God. Why are we yeah. so silly together? And then they flash back to the guy that he used to be murdering the whole yeah. town. They're like, see, you can change him. Yeah. <laughs> Love can do anything. Comes <laughs> in a lifetime. Oh. <laughs> it's a drunker, maybe something else movie review with yeah. Jose. Bolaños. And today we're listening to him review the new horror movie, Halloween Kills. <laughs> it's weird. Even though this is a horror movie, you'd never be able to tell. No. Oh, you're right. <laughs> based on this so far, we haven't heard a lot of frightening moments yet. It no. was scary. It you're was. You're usually so scared of everything. <laughs> yeah. No. Apparently, whatever you were on was yeah. making I was things good. very yeah. chill. After. Yeah. He's mostly that. focused on Mike Myers' gym regimen. Yeah. Yeah, I what mean, he'd be like as a kisser. They have that jumpsuit fit him perfect. You're very yeah. complimentary. Yeah. So okay. at this point, we just had to ask Jose, what was the scariest part of this movie? Oh, oh yeah, dude. I don't know if this is a spoiler, but there's a scene where there's a burning of burning building and the firefighters come and then all of a sudden, there's like a hole in the wall, and you look through it, and boom! Michael Myers' face, completely unscathed, just walking around this burning building like he's touring it, like he's about, like he wants to buy it. <laughs> he looks like he's going room to room, like, oh, two baths. I enjoy that. <laughs> this is a nice den. I could murder in here. I wish the ceilings were higher. <laughs> you know what? That is terrifying. He's in a that. burning building and he's literally that. just calmly walking. The housing he's... market is a scary place <laughs> yeah, right now. Figuring true. out how you're going to finance <laughs> this. God, and they want me to buy it with no inspection, yeah. I guess. Yeah. That's why cool. He's the only one that prefers an unfinished basement. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Also, uh, where are the hanging self. hooks? Yeah. <laughs> I'll finish it. <laughs> No, right. but... By the end of this, I just want to be friends with Michael Myers somehow. Oh, you guys. <laughs> you know, like, he's going to have a house party. He's got a good um, eye. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, now that we've heard the scariest part of the movie, <laughs> what was Jose's favorite part of Halloween Kills? Okay. Yes. I liked um, I liked that this guy brought the town together. <laughs> you know, by the end of this movie, the town had a chant. There was like a theme. It was like, evil dies, kill the evil tonight. I don't think anything has ever united people the way Michael Myers has <laughs> united people. I mean, I don't like to delve into politics, but Michael Myers for pres, maybe? Be president? You don't have to have experience. He wouldn't talk too much, which is the main problem with all presidents ever, ever. He literally wouldn't talk. He would just get the job done. Oh, North Korea's acting up? Kim Jong-il would be murdered, paper cut him to death with a laminate. We would not beef with literally anybody. I'm just saying, man. I think it would work. <laughs> okay. Uh, wow. I mean, you're going to be his campaign manager, aren't you? <laughs> What's his slogan? I, I don't know. Mask up, probably. Yeah. <laughs> for, for other reasons. Yeah. 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 Right. He'd definitely be leaving that. Yeah. Day. All right, now it's time for the moment that none of us have really been waiting for. <laughs> Not at all. Jose's final rating for Halloween Kills. Okay. I think the final rating is 8 out of 10 masks. Because... It feels like fall, and I want pumpkin spice. I want I want a bunch of kids around me, and I want to play in the leaves. 
And then when we when we're done planting the leaves, you just you know you watch a little bit of blood, you know, curdling, uh, gurgling murders. A little bit of Jason, a little bit of Michael Myers, a little Chucky. Hey, kids, want to see a doll? You kids like toys. Oh, you're six. You're probably good to see this. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Whose kids are these? <laughs> are you really just uh, having some, like, yeah. psycho killer? You there? love Michael Myers. I don't and, know. And, dude, your laugh could be haunting in a thriller. Hell yeah. Oh, I bet, yeah, I don't you know really haunts a lot That of could people. come out of a doll. I don't, yeah, yeah, doll. Yeah. I'm not really sure what you were on when you reviewed this movie, but yeah. all of our listeners want it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it makes everything happy, doesn't Apparently. it? Apparently. Yeah. Yeah. Life is good, even after a scary movie. Yeah, all right. So, so that was <laughs> Jose's Drunk or maybe something else. Probably movie something review. else. Yeah. Most likely. <laughs> Yeah. That was Halloween Kills. And text in to 78592. <laughs> Tell us what you thought of Jose's movie review. And if you're a fan of Halloween, just in general, yeah. oh. Brooke and Jeffrey's Halloween week starts yes. this Monday yes. morning. You're going to want to make sure you're here. It's going to be a lot of fun. Dude, yes. 10 masks out of 10 for this next week. Oh, let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> okay, bro. I'm excited. L- lower it a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Just give me candy. It's going to be a good time. Starts Monday morning. Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning.